a little bit more. I think we got them all. Mm. Oh. You just heard and saw those cracks. You want to stick around for the rest of the video. We've got plenty more cracks coming up from some of your favorite chiropractors. Make sure you subscribe. We post every day. Let's get into it. Up next, we have Dr. Brent Binder. Okay, well, give me an update. How? you feel? I'm super sore. Like Where all are you my sore? Muscles. Mostly my legs. Okay, but that's workout stuff. Mm -hmm. All right. Have you had any back pain or neck pain recently? Um, not recently, but like a couple months ago, I pinched, I pinched a nerve real hard. Mm -hmm. It was rough. I couldn't like I could not turn mm -hmm. either side. How um, how long ago was this? You said a couple months. Yeah, a couple months ago. Did the pain go? Did it go past your knee? Um, no, it was pretty much just through the hamstrings. Pretty good here. Very strong. Are, have you been working out in the gym too? Mm-hmm. So, your is here. Mm -hmm. Here. Mm -hmm. Here. Mm -hmm. Alright, so we'll focus down in here and make sure that we adjust this. <clears throat> Properly. Any neck pain, headaches? Mm, yeah. Well, it, does it feel more stuck one way? Mm -hmm. Yeah, definitely that way. To the right. Okay. I suppose yeah. that. Yeah, but it's not moving. So. Any pain, discomfort, tension when I push there? It's a little bit. Here? Yeah. So really L4. Let's see. Left or right? Left. When you had the, the pinched nerve, which leg did it go down? One side or both? I think it was both. Also, you're supposed to be sore after you work out. You can hip like this, go down. Left hip up, go down. Tender? Mm hmm Muscles.
Good sync and adjust. Practicing good. We'll start with that one right there. Okay, nice. A gentle breathing in through your nose. Good and out. Go let your shoulders sink in. And sink, 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 sink. Okay, deep breath in here, far as you can go. Good, and out. This time I'm gonna push at the top of the breath, like somewhere around there. Let's do that again, deep breath. I think I should breathe out. Oh. Tense or what? Does it feel tense? Okay, same thing, deep breath in. Good, and out. Good, that's good. Now pull your belly button up to your spine. Okay, deep breath in. Shoulders, there's more. Hold on. Okay, nice and gentle breathing. The hips down. I'm going to adjust the L4. Good, deep breath in. Good, shoulders. Going to bring this down a little bit more. Yeah. And you're back. Okay, turn your head to the right. Center, left, center. Nice. Yes. Okay, nice and gentle. Just gonna do some traction and start loosening up your neck. Super bendy neck. <laughs> nice and gentle. Nice and gentle. I'm going to lift the headpiece up just a little bit. Just try to let your head completely relax into the table. Nice gentle breathing. out to the side. Push, 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 relax. Go ahead, squeeze my fist again. Squeeze. Relax. It's a good one, right? Okay, I'm gonna start with the ileocecal valve. The ileocecal valve. Okay, so first I'm gonna place one hand on the belly button, okay? Then the ASIS here at the front of the hip bone. We're gonna connect these two points, start looking for the valve from there. Tenderness there. Yeah. This is where all these noises are coming from, right here. Really? Yeah. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna just kind of like dig in underneath of the diaphragm. We're just going to get rid of any adhesions or scar tissue or else. Thunder. You can feel that, right? It's happening mm -hmm. right where my hand is. Yeah. Literally pushing it right down the mm -hmm. line. Think we got them all? Mm. Do you crack your fingers or what?
<clears throat> can't bring your hands to your belly. All right, so this is a full spine adjustment. Awesome. If you made it to the end of the video, guys and girls, thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more.